So it gets wonky. I'm going to turn on a light, and we're just going to freaking start. It's actually per great. Awesome. This is exciting. My first live stream. <laughs> <Woo>! <laughs> yes! Live streams forever. Hello, Patrona, and hello, everyone else. We, we apparently have someone else here, because I just jumped in. We have four viewers. <laughs> Panda might be one of those, which he's not counting because he's not there. But um, we oh. are going to minimize. Cool. Cool. I can get rid of that. We're going to freaking see if we can get a really good sketch of beauty stem going here. Because as you can see, it's very not good and loose. <laughs> you, you say not good and I say oh my gosh teach me <laughs> I just wanted to have a base to your jet uh -huh. are, are you ready to learn oh my gosh teach me <laughs> I need all of you good artists to teach me all right including Patrona because oh my gosh Foxy she did the banner for the forum so cute oh yeah yes so cute and I can't wait to get Kickster Ashes up on the site, but I, I unfortunately... I have to see again. Uh, let me see. I have Temple of and I up, so... Freaking forum. I can drop you a link to the forum if you need it. Oh, yes! Oh my gosh, this was the, the cute one that I loved. <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes, I remember. Yes, and Patrona will also be joining us for the collaboration. She is going to be drawing for foot. Oh, <gasps> yay! Oh, you did the forum... The Temple of Bufonidae Forum uh, banner. I can I can make with words, darn it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, let's see. I feel so sad that the forum doesn't get more use, but that's because I'm totally ashamed of the, f the fact that the website has been ignored. We must spread the word. Nah, need to get my programmer off his butt. I mean, yes. at least at least I kind of have an excuse. He he doesn't. <laughs> Flexor tendonitis is totally an excuse. I'll well, say. It's been so miserable. I'm such a miserable person. No, <laughs> no I feel wabu. Uh, wabu. You Just can a... feel free to start talking about Toe Patrol at any point now. Yes, of course. I I made Lee Fox watch the first two episodes of Toe Patrol. Hey, hi, she totally hi. made me because I was strapped to a chair and <laughs> my eyes were open with tape and I was struggling and no, I, just, I wanted to. <laughs> Toe Patrol is my childhood too. Oh man. I actually remember there was a time when I would keep track of the dates by when shows aired and with, with Toe Patrol I was like, hmm, okay, so when did this particular episode air? Oh yeah, that's when this happened. <laughs> That's so funny. Uh, it is, but, you know, I just, I did that because... This is, there's nothing wrong with it. No. Because it's... Lord knows I loved my cartoons when I was growing up with them, too, but, like, I never likened them to a concept of time. <laughs> <laughs> I was so lost when I finally had to use calendars to keep track of time because I was... <laughs> oh, I know, Patrona. I'm so sad because season two... I mean, don't get me wrong, season one was good too, but season two was my favorite. It it was what changed my mind about the whole show initially. I mean, that isn't to say that I ever necessarily disliked Toe Patrol, but I think I was also one of those people who was like, a show about Toad? Ch children's show? <laughs> you know? <laughs> so, you know, when I started seeing episodes from season two and then went back and started watching episodes like The Cure... I was like, whoa, this show is, like, amazing, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I love those pleasant surprises. You go yeah. back and you see something, and it's like, wow, this is a lot better than I imagined. <laughs> and, you know, when you want someone new to watch the show, of course you've got to sit them down and be like, okay, so season one, just so you kind of understand what's going on here, and you get to know the characters and this and that, and, you know, you kind of have to say to them, like... Uh, and I don't want to say, like, you know, oh, don't worry, it gets better, but... <laughs> <laughs> but, but it I does! Think, it does, it does get better! <laughs> and, of course, you go back and you watch the early episodes later, and you're like, oh my gosh, this was the beginning of something amazing. 
And, you know, you actually start to really just appreciate the first episodes, too. I mean, without the first episodes, you wouldn't have the later ones. It, it makes my heart happy. Yeah. And I also appreciate how dark it was. I mean, I was at Run for the Toad a couple of years ago. A couple of years ago, I feel so old. Anyway, <laughs> I was there. And they had the, the Thunder Tree Cinema set up. It was um, a tent where you could actually go in and you got to watch VHS tapes of the episodes. And that is the whole <clears> reason why I went to this place because you know forget the kids that that stuff was my childhood the kids watch episodes amazing. screw the kids Jeez. screw the kids <laughs> <laughs> i'm horrible anyway i got in there and i i remembered i didn't ever really get to see temple of before die as a kid and i was watching it and i was just amazed <laughs> patrona will go together i'm telling you right now we go together I'll drag you there, kicking and screaming. You too, Lee Fox, so don't laugh. <laughs> As kicking and screaming with tied to the chair and the eyes glued <laughs> yes, open <pride> again. <laughs> yeah, and the eyes pried open. <laughs> so, uh, I just, I went there and I watched Temple of Bufona Die for the first time. This was 2009? Me. Anyway, it was the least sugar-coated episode I had ever seen. There was one scene in there, um, I can't quote it directly, because I only saw the, the episode, like, what, twice in the entire entirety of when I saw it, but there was one scene where, um, Belisarius, who was the bat, uh, the bat villain, was, uh, was basically accusing the Toe Patrol of be being the reason that there were ghosts in the cavern, and, uh, aw, well... I, it's been years now. I only ever get to see it at the at the Thunder Tree Cinema. I'm so sad. Are you in Toronto, Patrona, or somewhere close by? Because I mean, the Temple, the uh, bleh, the the Run for the Toad runs once a year, and it's in Cambridge. It's in Cambridge. I mean, it's not not too far away. Tiger Jet, I don't want to sound like a jerk or anything, but how many people come, go to that? A lot, actually. A lot, okay. but, but I mean, it's it's for the marathon, and they do uh, what was it, fundraising and such. Okay. So I mean, they go for that, and essentially, the people who are running the marathons, uh, mostly adults, but I mean, there are people who basically shove their kids into the cinema, like here, just wait here until I get back. <laughs> you know, a good thirty or forty people, but you know, I tend to stay late, so I get the cinema all to myself. Woo! No shame. None. <laughs> I actually, none whatsoever. None whatsoever. <laughs> oh my gosh, I think she's adorable so far. She is! Oh my gosh. She's... Mm, wish I could draw this well. <laughs> this is turning out good. I'm, I'm glad. I'm sorry. I don't mean to interrupt you. Go ahead. No, please. I love it. I mean, it's all, it's all Toe Patrol and amazing. And it's just like, oh, that sketch was really bad, but I can actually draw. Just wait. Hang on. <laughs> <laughs> I thought even the setup was beautiful, so I don't even want to hear it. Oh, that setup was terrible. I'm just like, okay, I need like a quick something to go here, and then I'll work on it later. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to see your fur foot, Patrona. I mean, I think everybody is adorable so far. Seriously, I'm loving what I see so far. Mm hmm. I was actually, um, I was, co I was commenting about Minish May, who, uh, submitted the Elf Cup. And I'm just like, I'm just amazed off, off, how off to a good start she is. Because, I mean, <laughs> when I started, when I started drawing toadlets, oh, they all looked crippled. <laughs> nice. <laughs> they so did. They so did. And of course, Spotty has the cutest little style. <laughs> oh my, yes. How's that comic going? Oh yeah, Patrona, how's your comic going? I'll finish my story in a moment, but I am interested. Uh, control save. La la la. Patrona must fill us in. I'm also curious as to what it's about, but <laughs> not gonna pry too much. Let there be surprises. Must have surprises. Oh my gosh, Foxy. Yes. I'm gonna stick my hands to the computer screen and give you a big old hug. <laughs> She's <Do> adorable. <laughs> <laughs> Do it, Tinker Jet. I want Tinker Jet hugs. Yay. I um, think the reason 
why I wanted Beauty Stem is because I totally know that she's going to be a character that just appeals to me. Plus, she's dressed in green. She she is dressed in green. And her <laughs> name is Beauty Stem. <laughs> yeah. Hey, my, I'm, I'm shameless because my favorite character is Panther Cap, and he's also got green going on in his scheme. What's up? He does. What's up? Okay, let's see. Patrona, Patrona replied here now. Getting all kinds of Topo feels. Get that comic plan soon. You better get that comic plan soon. There's actually an animation I want to do eventually, a Toe Patrol animation, but I've I've got to got to get better first. We're working on it. It's been so many years, oi. Yeah. <laughs> I uh I took a course for um animation back in high school. It was back in the day. Oh my yes. Those were the days. Yep. <laughs> The days. Oh my gosh, my animation was terrible, but I mean, <coughs> the sad part is, is that I can animate just fine. It's my art that's terrible. You know, she, the lies. Animation. she lies through her teeth. This, oh, fine. This, this was back in 2004. It was terrible. <laughs> okay, well, fine. I'll give you that one. But you lie through your teeth if you mean like recently. You just lie. She's you know, a liar. Compared, compared to 2004, I'm amazing, okay? <laughs> you best be believing it. Compared to 2004, oi. Yeah, I mean, I'm I've, I've still got a lot to do, but I mean, I was I took the animation course back in high school, which was 2004 to 2007. You know, those years. Anyway, around there. Hey, Puffball's also got green going on in his scheme. A lot of green in this show. I love it. <laughs> I guess you can't be in the forest and escape green. The, I'm not complaining. <laughs> Beauty Stem also has, like, my favorite... Well, not my favorite, but close to my favorite shade of green, which is that light... The like, light peridot, green. almost lime, but not really. Yeah. I I do think you'll like Beauty Stem. And, and she's got purple! And she's purple got purple. Yeah, purple. Doubt purple. Doubt purple. Love doubt purple. And just FYI, Puffball's amazing. I, I do think you'll like Puffball too, Foxy, once you get deeper in the series. Like, I know he seems just like a cranky butt right now, but he's actually quite funny. Yeah, he, he really <laughs> does. He, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I totally appreciate the fact that he's a cranky butt. I, I know that's odd, but I, I, I do. It's just... Kind of reminds me of me, actually. <laughs> there's, there's gotta be one. There always has to be one. Actually... And ours is Max. <laughs> uh, no, I think Shag- well, I'd say Shaggy Mane is our Max, but actually Shaggy Mane is a competent writer. <laughs> uh, yeah, so no, we're- You know what, that's not fair, because no, you wouldn't consider anyone in the Toe Patrol to be Max, because they're all competent. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they're all, they're all competent in something, which is more than Max would say. I feel terrible! I feel terrible, I'm gossiping, this is terrible. <laughs> Yeah, no shame. No shame. <laughs> anyway. None. We haven't heard from him in days, so I don't want to hear it. Pfft. Yeah. Pettiness activates. I know, right? <laughs> I told Panda that, and he's like, well, I mean, do you really care? Like, why is it bothering you? Do you miss him? I was like, no, but you could at least tell me he's alive, you know? <laughs> yeah, true. I, I feel bad because I do actually kind of miss him because I'm silly and loyal, but then I know I get into a call again with him, and he bugs me, and then kind of going back to, why did I miss you again? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I've known him for so many years, it's just one of those things, you know? It's like, Ugh, no matter how much you bug me! You, you've grown attached to certain people. Mm -hmm. They're second nature to you. Yes. <laughs> That's exactly it. It's like, uh, life just wouldn't feel right without you. And then again, why do I do this to myself? <laughs> Seriously, it's a pain in the rear end to talk to you. All yeah. the time. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> this gossip aside. I probably I probably should finish the story I was telling before. Oh, yes. Um, yeah, I, I went into the uh, the Thunder Tree Cinema and I watched uh, the Temple of Bufonidae episode. And there was an episode, because we were talking about uh, things being uh, not sugar-coated in Toe Patrol. And... Belisarius, the bat villain, was essentially accusing them of being the reason why ghosts were appearing in the cavern. She's so adorable. Okay, okay. don't look at it. <laughs> don't look at She's it. She's like, I will steal your soul. <laughs> no, no. If there's one thing that Beauty Stem 
If there is one thing that Beauty Sam is not, she's not Dora the Explorer, okay? <laughs> it's very important. Just, I know, right? She doesn't stare through your soul and take take ownership of it. It's very important with characters like these when their eyes are so big that you make sure that their eyes match up with one another. Otherwise, you know, you got people looking at it and one eye is significantly gigantic, more gigantic than the other, and they're just like, hmm, something doesn't look right here. <laughs> you mean, like, Jiggers from Mickey Arbuckle, who just has, like, this one really long eye and one really tiny one. <laughs> yeah, and then you're like, hmm, I don't, I don't know. Don't know one how I feel about this. It's just not like the other, that's right. <laughs> anyway. Oh my gosh, I keep get derailing from my story. Anyway, um, there was, there was one scene where, you know, Elf Cup was listening to the bat basically going on about there with the accusations that they're the reason ghosts are in the cavern and then she says um i don't believe you because uh this is obviously not exactly what she said but uh she said that you know i don't, I don't believe you because ghosts don't exist and essentially the bat responds by saying uh oh, oh really we'll see about that and then attempts to drown them in sand and I'm just kind of, I, I saw that scene, I'm like, whoa, this was approved for children? Okay! Okay! <laughs> what kind of children? Because, whoa! <laughs> Darkest episode of the series of mine. Like, life. children who want to <clears throat> burn ants with magnifying glasses? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I, I was not one of those one of those children. I think I took no. my darkness out on the series that I watched, because a lot of the series I watched were remarkably dark like red wall and silver wing it's just kind of the kind of person i was i think i told you at one point that one of the lightest shows i watched as a kid was blasters universe and that was just a show that was two kids dorking around uh in space and yes red wall and silver wing amazing shows back in the day back in the day those were the days shoot i feel left out now my shows were like tiny tunes and rocko's modern life and Tiny Toons was amazing. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> yes! Yes, it was. Tiny mm. Toons and Sonic's at AM. I know you watched Sonic's at AM. Oh, Sonic's at AM. Just Jim Cummings. <laughs> yes, Jim Cummings. And J.L. White. Yes! yes. Oh my gosh, J.L. White. <laughs> Patronus says that Rocco's modern life scared her. Oh, really? No, I see where you're. I definitely see where you're coming from with that. Rocco's modern life was, like, not for everyone. <laughs> Ren and Stimpy scared me. Ren and Stimpy was also not for everyone, and <laughs> I can see where it totally scared them too, but I don't know. Ren and Stimpy was one of those shows where I freaking loved it as a kid, and then Netflix yeah, has it now, so I went back and watched it, and I'm like, why did I like this? <laughs> <laughs> it was so weird. Mm-hmm. I just... I, I still like it, though. It? <laughs> hey, you're, you're entitled to like what you want. Darren like, Tootin, everyone's opinions are accepted here. That's well, right. Okay, maybe not all of the opinions, but all of the like and dislike of cartoon shows is accepted here. I don't care. <laughs> I never watched The Weekenders. I, wasn't that one, the one with, uh, shoot, the one with uh, Tish and Carver and those other ones? Let me see. I'm trying to remember their names. Tish, no, I'm thinking the Adams I, family. I, I am spot on. I remember that show. Unfortunately, I never really got a chance to watch it. Laura and Tino. I knew I was missing. How did I forget Tino? Wasn't he the one who always introduced what was going on? <laughs> uh, anyway. I don't know. I. Yes. Okay. I remember something about the show. Yay. Uh, I need to put shows like these on Netflix, I swear. Right? Also, Netflix has a pretty good array going on now, though. Uh, you have it on the American Netflix. Every time I go to the Canadian Netflix, I am so ashamed. <laughs> I, I just don't get why that isn't shared. You know, I, th I think it's because different rights and other nonsense that Netflix has to deal with. They can license it in one country, but it doesn't make it licensed in another. Hola. Hola. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, big time la die. Oh my gosh, I just want to hug her. She's so cute. <laughs> Do it, hug her. Uh, Toe Patrol is not on Netflix, Canadian or American, and I think that is such a because <clears throat> they could probably get it for cheap too. You know? Yeah, because I mean, licensing rights. The contract with Toe Patrol already expired, so I don't see any reason why they wouldn't 
be able to. Mm-hmm. I mean, there's a lot of shows where contracts have expired that they could just pick up and they don't. Like, why don't they pick up Daft Planet? Daft Planet's, what? They're stupid, let's see, 2000, 2002. Most contracts last eight years. So it's probably been around, like, at least two years since that contract has run out. Why don't they just pick it up? Stick it on there. Duh. Duh. And, <laughs> and with Taupe Troll, I mean... The only thing they would have to contend with is the trademark on Mistletoad's name, but I mean, you know, that's that's easy enough. Let's see if that works. Uh, I don't think Shout Factory. Hmm? Oh, uh, in in regards to uh, Daft Planet or Toe Patrol, because I I don't think Toe Patrol was uh, done by Shout Factory. I think they were. Uh, what was it Funbag was the distributor? I think that would be amazing though if somebody else could pick up the Toe Patrol DVDs because apparently Funbag does not know how to do a proper release of a show. <laughs> I've actually messaged Funbag before. I I don't enjoy their responses. It's so sad. They all automated and like you're not important to us essentially. No, it's not even that. They like I I feel like they're actually making some kind of effort, but at the same time, it's like, yeah, so until Teletoon airs Toe Patrol again, we, we're not releasing the rest of the DVDs. I'm like, that's bogus! Well then, looks like they're never gonna come out, so thanks. Yeah, exactly. So, then it's like, well, hey, Teletoon! Uh, about that show that you aired last, like, nine years ago now? Can you bring that back for us? Isn't the suits in there are like, what? What what is this show? What what are you even? We're we're moving. We're doing the same thing as Cartoon Network. We're moving toward live action because who likes cartoons anymore? <laughs> Don't even get me started. Who likes cartoons anymore anyway? Freaking talking to a cartoon purist here. Yeah, same. You want live action on your Cartoon Network? Get out of my face. You know. <laughs> I don't even understand because it's called Teletoon and Cartoon Network. Seriously? What is this? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Hello, welcome to Cartoon Network, the number one broadcaster of live action. No. <laughs> no, stop it. <laughs> stop it right now. Ugh. It is really silly. I think this is why I need to get my own my own station or something. That'd be pretty that'd be pretty sweet. Get my own station, call it something with cartoons, and make sure it stays. And make sure it stays that way. That yes. sounds fantastic. Yep. You know, Tink, I'm reminded of the episode of Family Guy where Peter makes his own TV <laughs> station. <laughs> oh man, if I could afford it, imagine how fantastic that would be. I want in on that. That's how fantastic it would be. Oh yeah. I think Teletoon Retro mostly airs, uh, 80s and early 90s stuff. Toe Patrol kind of came out like right at the end of the 90s there. So it'll probably be a few more years before it sees retro. Yeah. I'm not saying it's impossible. I'm just saying it might take a little longer. <laughs> right. Teletoon Retro would, would be super sweet if it had Toe Patrol on it. I have to, I have to wonder because I know Teletoon... Let me see. Funbag owned a quarter of the rights. Quarter of the rights was owned by... Mm, da, 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 da. Teletoon also, I think, had a hand in Toe Patrol, so I don't think it would be hard for them. I think they actually own part of the rights to the show, unless they had a contract I don't know about. There. Like, uh, I know that I can't get anyone else aside from Funbag to distribute the DVDs, because Funbag owns a quarter of the rights. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, it wasn't hard to find this stuff back in the day. I mean, it was right on the Fun Bag site that they owned a quarter of the rights to the show. And then I remember I, I spoke to Jack Wilson. Oh, this was years ago. Like, I don't know if anybody remembers the Quizilla days where you could make a quiz and put them online. It was, it was really kind of lame, but I did it anyway. And uh, I actually had... I, I received an email from Jack Wilson, who found mine because I made a Toe Patrol quiz. And he's like, oh my gosh, this is the cutest thing. And I'm and just 
happiest day of my life right there. Like, oh my gosh, people who actually work for shows actually talk to the fans? <gasps> <laughs> So happy. Wow, they're not all a-holes. That's right. The executive is talking to me. He's taking time out of his busy day to say hi. <laughs> it's almost like I'm a person. <laughs> that's, that's it. And it looks like we have someone else in here. Hello, hello, whoever you are, random guest. It's nice to see. Oh my goodness, I, I forgot to let people know that the live stream is going right now. Yeah, I was thinking about that and maybe just taking a break and just posting on DeviantArt. But I don't know. I didn't even get any comments. So it's just whatever. Well, I know people actually watch this journal, so I'm just going to be like, hey, guess what? Streaming right now. Come and join us. We're yep. talking about stuff, stuff and junk. And junk, and more junk, and see, it's yeah. kind of amazing in here. It is. I feel amazing. <laughs> they have three fingers. Cool. <laughs> yep. I feel very amazing. This is my first successful live stream, and hopefully, want to do many. You more will to have come. many, many more, many, many more. Yeah. And I shall shamelessly promote because you are amazing and should be promoted. Tinker will shamelessly join me. You're in Skippy. All the time. Alright, so All the time. I dropped it into the group. Ian, gonna drop it. Oops. Because I, I said in my journal that we're streaming, but I didn't say where the stream was. <laughs> I'm smart. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is there a good collaboration? Just try. Uh, da -da -da -da. Uh, let's see, how would this hand go? I'm super smart face. That's... Tinker Jet is super smart face. I don't care what anyone else says. <laughs> uh, super dumb Sorry face. Sorry for sometimes. that noise. My microphone's rubbing against my glasses. Need to get a new pair. Oh my goodness, where am I? Oh, more options. Is that it? Is minor? Nope. I want everybody. Everybody must see. Everybody must know. Because this beauty stem is beyond amazing. She's super cute so far. <laughs> I'm sorry, Patrona. I didn't mean to make you run around circles. <laughs> uh, I, I did leave the link to your page, though, so... That's, that's at least something, but I didn't actually... I just left a click here to join, so hopefully we will have some people joining us. That'd be amazing. I would love that. We have a party! Are you kidding? It's already a party in here. <laughs> party, party, party. <laughs> so, Tinker, do you have anything, let's see, group related or your life related that you would like to share? Like what you're doing recently or what your plans are? <laughs> like shamelessly promoting my comic? I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm not going to. Well, I didn't say that, but if you want, you can elaborate. <laughs> <I'm just kidding. laughs> well, yeah, I'm doing a webcomic. I don't know if anyone would actually be interested in that. It's not It's not based on Toe Patrol, but, you know, if you like video games, it's kind of off to a slow start, but I mean, you know, it's, it's, on, it's on DeviantArt, so you can get the, the updates. Video games, yes. And now we have six people. Cool. Hi, strangers! Don't be shy. Seriously. <laughs> nah, you don't have to talk if you don't want to. <laughs> we are here for your entertainment. This, yeah. And I don't know how I want this hand to be. So I think I'm just going to go back to it. Come back to it later. People are welcome to join the chat, but if they are shy, they don't have to. That's just the way it goes. Uh, doop, doop. All right. Ah, no, don't do that. <sighs> Oops. <laughs> nickname, okay. I can do that. You need to do a nickname? What? Well, I mean, you know, just temporary nicknames. So, ah. so I can send messages. I'm not logged in, so. Hey, Tinkerjet, you can totally shamelessly pitch your live stream channel here. I don't give a crap. <laughs> well, I'm not doing anything on my live stream channel yet, so nothing really to pitch yet. Maybe later. And Patrona, you are welcome to talk to us. We are happy to have you here because happy people 
We all need to be happy people. Yes. We need to... We need to share the love a little bit. Yes, that's right. Aw, someone left. Someone got shy. <laughs> that's someone thought, okay. Someone thought there was too much of a party. Not a party animal. I didn't expect this to be a big thing. I honestly didn't expect to have anyone, so I'm happy to have you here, Patrona. That's amazing. <laughs> Let the party begin. Yeah, I'm terrible. Don't mind me. <laughs> uh, let's see. 